What's going on YouTube? Just finished gym. Just finished battering some, what did we do? Arms, uh, some deadlifts. Went to that other gym today. It's quite good, good little workout. I'm tired, about to go have some, a, ve a vegetarian post-workout meal. That's what we're about to do right now, man. Um, yeah, I was listening to this audio book. Um, when I was, uh, I've done a bit of cardio today. And as you guys know, I like to listen to audio books when I do cardio. I was listening to this audio book and I, uh, I've got the, I can't think of the name. It's in my phone, but I don't want to use my phone. It's police around there. Um, uh, the audio book, yeah. So in the audio book, it was basically talking about the saying, never give up. Um, and how important that saying is in life. Like it's, it, it gets thrown about. Um, it gets thrown about like, it, oh, never give up, or, or just, you know, don't give up on, on what you want to do and this and that. But people don't really, they don't really see the meaning behind never giving up. Never giving up means it, it's such a, like, a, it's such a massive saying. There's so much, um, there's so much behind the saying. And what, what this audiobook was saying is, um, if you have dreams and goals or you have aspirations, things you want to do in life, what you'll find is that, to get to them goals, or to, to get to, re let's say for example, you wanna become a boxer, for example. Say you're good at fighting, you're good at boxing, you, you've got good stamina, and you wanna become a, a world heavyweight champion in boxing. Just for example, um, what you'll find is that if you say that to someone, if you're an average Joe, and you say to a friend or a family member, and they say, what do you wanna do with your life? And you say, you know what, I'm gonna become a world heavyweight boxer. I'm gonna become the champion. They'll look at you and think you're crazy. And, and, and I know a lot of, you know, I, I went through this myself, you know, in, in certain aspects of my life. You know, they'll look at you like, yeah, all right, you're gonna do that, but what are you gonna do as a job, you know? You ever get them kind of people? And you know what, it's always friends and family that always do that, have you noticed that? Like, it's always your close friends that say, yeah, right, this and that, and they're always the first people to put you down. You know, and, and I've had that myself, you know, with this YouTube game, what I'm doing right now, I want to become, I want to become a famous YouTuber, I want to, I want to have millions of subscribers, I want people to watch my videos, to love my videos, to like what I'm trying to do, you know, so with this YouTube hustle, I've had close friends say to me, what the fuck are you doing, like, and, and, you know, saying, yeah, it's never going to work, and this and that, there's too many YouTubers out there, but you have to think of things like, if you think about someone like, let's say, let's say Mike Tyson, for example, let's use Mike Tyson, I'm using loads of boxing um, examples, but let's say Mike Tyson, when Mike Tyson, before he was a boxer, and someone said to Mike, what do you want to do? And he was a fight, you know, he liked fighting, he was, he was strong, you know, and he said, what do you want to do with your life? He probably said, I want to become the world heavyweight champion of the world. They probably laughed at him. They ridiculed him. They probably said, oh, shut up, this and that. You know, you're talking shit, which everybody would do, you know. And what you'll find is with people with goals and aspirations like myself, when these people do this, a lot of people use this as, you know what, you're right. I need to go and become a normal person. Because you know what, the people that do that nine times out of ten, they ain't got no goals themselves, they ain't got no aspirations, they don't want to do anything with their lives, you know? They want to just be average Joes, go to work, come home, go back to work, come home, uh, weekend, live for the weekend, just live for a Saturday night getting drunk, that's their only little bit of happiness. And that's it, you know, and it's sad, you know, and, and what they do, instead of like, um, you know, saying, you know what, you can do it, or go and do that, or if you say, you know, I want to become, like for me, for example, I want to become like a famous YouTuber, a motivational speaker, you know, because I came from like a really shitty background, you know, uh, I came from like a rough, rough neighborhood, I didn't have much growing up, I was in and out of prisons and stuff, and I've drastically changed my life, you know, I, I, I'm always constantly working on myself, I'm always reading, I'm always, you know, I'm listening to, um, you know, like motivational speakers, I'm, um, you know, I'm, I'm always, you know, studying, I'm trying to get my mind, you know, perfect, and I, and I want to, I want to just, I want information overload, you know, I'm always looking for new ways to do things, and, 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 and I know, I don't get bored, because I'm always studying, I'm always learning, I'm always procrastinating, you know, and, and, and you know, what you'll find with these people is that when they haven't got dreams, aspirations, and they ain't got nothing to look forward to, they want to put you down, 
I don't want to bring you to their level and people have done this with me man listen my YouTube channels I've got I've got a few YouTube channels and you know some of them do better than others but you know like my YouTube channels like this one for example okay it doesn't have many subscribers at the moment so you know someone else will probably think you know what this is taking ages I might as well just give up it's not gonna work but me I think fuck this you know what my YouTube channel started at one subscriber look at it now we're on like I even checked it lately I think it's like 70 80 subscribers and you know what I do get people commenting I get people coming I've got like videos some of them have like 5,000 views some have 700 and I'm still I'm still learning I'm still growing I'm still trying to you know understand how to market this shit man so you know I'm still going so if I would have listened to these people friends family saying you know what it's not gonna work or laughing and saying oh what are you trying to do like trying to motivate people and that like because you know a lot of people when I talk about the law of attraction and, and not being around negative people because it, it affects your life people will probably think oh stop talking shit like it doesn't that doesn't work you know because there's a lot of people out there that are so focused on being normal you know and what the fuck is normal man normal is boring why does anyone want to be like normal you know the law of attraction works negativity positive thinking all that kind of stuff works I don't care what anybody says you know but never ever ever give up use them people as your fuel you know if they're saying it's not going to work or be, be real and be realistic and all this what the fuck is realistic I always use the right brothers because they you know like I've read books on there read their biographies I, I always use the right brothers the right brothers said we're gonna make this we're gonna make this vehicle whatever it was make this machine and what it's gonna do is gonna like it's gonna trans transport people from one side of the the continent to another side and to a different country and people thought these people are crazy what the fuck are they talking about today planes virgin atlantic easy jet all this shit they're fucking billion billion trillion dollar businesses and these guys done it like so don't worry if people are saying oh it's not going to work or you're crazy to think you're going to be able to do this and do that never ever give up on your fucking dreams don't ever do that don't give these people um don't give these people a chance to say i told you so don't give them that if they say it's not going to work Prove them wrong. Use their fucking negativity as fuel and do what the fuck you have to do to succeed in this fucking life because this life is short. I don't want to be a normal person. You shouldn't be a normal person. If you don't want to be a normal person that goes to work, comes home, lives a shitty life um, and, you know, and, and doesn't have much to look forward to, then cool, be that. But if you don't want to be that, you don't have to. You determine, you determine your own future the way you want your life. I always say this, man. So listen, never ever give up. Use negative people as fuel and live your dreams and do what the fuck you want with your life.